Welcome back to Virtual Reality. My name is Thomas and you're watching Voodoo DEVR. Today we will again play Star Wars Tales from the Galaxy's Edge, but this time on the PlayStation VR 2. So I want to show you how the game looks on the PlayStation VR. I'm really looking forward to show you that. Thank you to my sponsors, Woodcoast VR, Oppermann Events, Virtual Escape and Slim Beats. Let's have some fun with the video and let's go. Voodoo.de Okay guys, welcome to the game. So as I already, already said, I played this and showed this game before on my channel, so this will not be such a long video. I just want to show you how it looks and how it... So it's... The first thing, it's very smooth. It's... Uh, I mean, you see that on YouTube, but uh, for me it's very smooth and the graphics are so much better. It's... It looks so... Everything looks so sharp. Yeah, look at look at the outside here and and every details here of of all that stuff. It just looks so good. Look at this little drone here. Awesome. I mean, the if you have the PlayStation VR 2, you you should definitely if you like Star Wars, this is a must have in my opinion at least. You should definitely play that. <coughs> Uh, so uh, here we have our missions where we have to go. It's there, and uh, we also have uh, <laughs> a, a menu here, so there we can do some stuff with the audio, uh, language, difficulty, position, movement. If we like teleport or smooth locomotion, then some things for motion sickness. Uh, height and left and right handed here we can uh, yeah travel in the universe protocol what we uh, stuff we find uh, found uh, some things that w achievements stories and yeah the settings so that's uh, really nice it feels so good Wow, it looks good, guys. Really, it looks so good. I know you also, we can teleport here as well. But did you ever think it would be as glamorous as doing things like scanning Bart's containers? Wow. Credits or what? Yeah, that's credits. Uh, how how can we scan? Uh, what was that again? I, I'm not sure. Oh. Oh. Wait, there there was uh, the tracking lost. I, I've never had that before. So nice. I I'm not sure. How can we scan that? I, I, I don't remember. Here. Oh wait. Yeah. Chest with droid parts. So remember when we were on Trent Ocean you stopped at that diner? Well, I interfaced with the security droid, and it told me they allow droids in the resistance. But General Organa herself sometimes travels with a protocol droid. <laughs> Can you imagine? That could be me one day. I prefer to pilot for them, but I call that woman's king. Or whatever, General's will. How can I use that? This one? Nah, no, that's the medikit, right? Where is that again? Yeah, it should be this one, but... Sometimes it's... I'll describe... I'll wait here, yeah. Uh, here, it's a very small display here that you can see. <laughs> nice. Ok, 
Okay. Here we go. You can scan that again. Unknown package. when a cloaked traitor in the corner of a dimly lit cantina pays you a lot of credits to transport two special packages? This is like that, but we're certainly not smuggling them. But we're probably also not not smuggling them. <laughs> uh, sure. Just get them planet side. <laughs> they are crazy. Hmm. So that's the mission, guys. That's what we needed. How can we get back there? What was that again? Uh, uh, not sure. Here. How can we get get back up there? What's that? Ah, flame pack. And now? Here we go. Nice, here we are, back again. And that looks so good. Oh, I love it. Look at this. That's a very that means uh, let me just confirm. Yes, you're going to have to turn on the docking beacon from there. They're approaching from Wow, the look at this so cool. I love it. So yeah, the next mission would be to transfer the the containers and stuff. It's just so nice. So, as I said, this won't be a long video. I just wanted to show you how it looks. And it's just amazing. It's It looks so good. It feels so good. You should really get it. So, guys, let's go back to the studio and talk about it. Okay, it's Star Wars Tales from the Galaxy's Edge. So, guys, if you have the PlayStation VR 2 and you love 1% Star Wars, you should buy that. The... There is no better way to get this Star Wars immersion than, than this way. So with the new PlayStation VR 2, you have so good tracking with the controls. You can turn around, you have your hands and your, fing your fingers and all that stuff. So there is no better way to experience Star Wars. Just buy it. Okay, it's 50 bucks. It's a lot, but it's worth it. It's just amazing. So I hope you liked my video. Give me a thumbs up. Thank you for watching and see you next time in virtual reality. See ya.